Fractured butthole. <laughs> <laughs> right. We're on to the music, music section of the podcast where we talk about music. Duh. Facts. Hey, some people might be slow. Has anybody heard the Big Crits album? No. I did. You did? What y'all think of this is now? That was pretty lit. What'd you think, bro? It was a great album, man. Like one, of, one of the better rap albums this year? I was with 85 South, so, you know what I mean? I like how he had the little interludes with them in this and uh, just in general, like the way it flowed, Bring the, mic the samples, you know what I mean? The guy, he, he did his thing. And I like that he branching out and working with other producers and shit now. Mm-hmm. You and know, I like um, Shaq's favorite rapper. Who? Oh, was that? Uh, J. Cole. Hey, bro, come on. Hey, my oh, favorite rapper, rapper, bro. Cole, my hey, name, uh, bro. in terms of like rap albums this year, where do you think you will put it? Because we haven't really had that many good ones. We haven't really had that many great ones. I it's don't it's think up there, man. Was there it's up there already. Last year. No. Last year was Bro, last year smoked. Last year we was bombarded with rap albums. Yeah, you were. Right. Yeah, we got sweet. three classics <laughs> in like a month That's... last year. No, but I'm saying like by this time. Uh, no. Last year. No. Like, Daytona. Mm-hmm. 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 But, Jorge, what do you think about that? Some good ones came out at the end of the year, though. Yeah, yeah, we got like uh, Astro World came out in what was it August? September? August. Oh. Scorpion too. What'd you say? Astro. You say Astro? Don't forget about Scorpion. Hey, bro. <laughs> Fuck that up. Hey, actually, we, I had an interesting conversation with Chase about that. That I'm gonna bring it up later. Uh, yeah, probably. He he don't let a year go by no more, unfortunately. But uh, <laughs> he's the next Call of Duty rapper. But Ooh. come on. Drake. Fact. Hey, what's his Call of Duty ghost? Is it views? Yeah. Hey, Drake. <laughs> Drake is currently in album mode. Let's get it. I, 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 look, I am not a, I, no, wait, pause. I am not afraid of Drake when he's in album mode anymore. After what Pusha did to him. Wait, hey, uh, album mode is not scary. Who sold more? Who sold more? Sells the Pusha didn't do nothing This grid album. Shut up, bro. Damn. That's why I, we're not getting into this again, nigga. He lost the beef. It's over. Can we please talk about my boy Crit? What's the point of, hey, hold on. This Crit review. Like a million times, bro. Niggas know Drake lost, but they can't admit it. It's okay. Yeah, he's, 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 he's still the biggest rapper in the world. Exactly. He's still the beef with Pusha T last year. I'll right, just flip the switch. What'd you say? Flip, flip. I just flipped the switch. This nigga. The Crit album, it was cool. It's it's. I don't know if I liked it as much because there hasn't been that many good rap albums this year. Like if it came out last year, would I like it as much? Probably not. But it was still good. Like I'll give it like you know a solid eight, eight out of eight point five. Okay. It's uh, not as good as Forever is a mighty long time to me because I think that album was great. That was probably my favorite rap album of like twenty seventeen when it came out. Mm. Like that shit, especially that song where he got smoked by Pimp C. Chase, thoughts? <laughs> Drake definitely didn't get smoked by Pimp C with that horrible with that horrible feature he had. Got more like uh, stand out. Yeah, I feel you. I, it was more on music like on there. You know, I I still run back to the yeah, album man. now. This one I might I, really don't, I, I might run back to it, but we'll see. Well, uh, uh, every crit album got them songs that you, you know, except Cadillac. Shut up, Cadillac has like like good songs. Bro, I hate that album. That shit is ass. Right, but uh, I I feel like with this album, um, it was a different effort from Crit because it's not. Crit's usual thing where he produces all his songs and he raps on his songs. I feel like he he went to other producers on this album and he got them and he basically kind of like he had more of a mainstream feel to it. More hype? Is it more hype? No, I I feel like it has more it has more of a mainstream feel to it. But I feel like Big Crit puts his own spin to it because the tempo is high. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah. Oh yeah, the tempo was high. I think you said hype. That's why I say a hype meant like. Oh, I thought you meant hype like it's just bangers all over. No. No, but some of the songs, like, you know, he was just, some songs didn't have too much of that uniqueness to it, but I like some songs on here. Like, one of the songs I like on here is Make It Easy, uh, Believe, Prove It, a Blue Fame, uh, Ballet, Ballet, and uh, Mississippi, which was probably one of the best songs on this album. I ain't heard it yet, so. Um, I think he only produced one song on this album. This song, this album is under Forever is a Marty Long Time, but it's not as bad as, like, Live from the Underground or anything like that. But it's not better than Forever is a mighty long time. I give it like a I give it like an eight, eight and a half. I'll finish it tonight, man. But I really like the album. No, nah, Freddie's project is probably like a ten. What? She said Freddie Gibbs. I mean, no, I like Big Crits more because to me it was more ambitious Big shit. for him. 
because usually more of his al- usually his albums he, he does did. all his productions right. on this album he only did so, like one song produced bless uh, he did even though for, that you wouldn't expect him to do yeah exactly exactly except for that Rico sounds. love song it sounds like pay atten- like it's, it sounds like pay attention part two you like the little nah, sounds, yeah, yeah. Like I like addiction that. but see that's the thing it sounds Which all these songs sound super different from usual crit what do you think about the Lil Nas X feature <sighs> Please don't disrespect Big Crit. No, <laughs> Big Crit slander this Lil Nas month. X is the biggest artist right now, bro. Now, Bandana is a better album, but I like Crit's album more because it was more ambitious to me. Hello, you like Crit album more than Bandana? Ambitious? I enjoy it more. Oh, you enjoy it more. But, I know, saying, that, but I know that Bandana floors this album. Who's a better rapper? Fetty? Freddie or uh, Crit? That's not even a... Yeah, Freddie rap circle. That's like comparing yeah. Jake Holder. He, he rap circles. Yeah. I don't think he can rap circles. Freddie gives a rap circle. I don't think he do. Nah, he, 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 he will. He'll be I right. think th- th- yes. that Crit is on like the... He can rap. He can rap. Both of them can rap. I think Crit is like on the cold level of like lyricism. Yeah, he is. Where I put Freddie up there with like... Kendrick or somebody. MF Doom? Yeah, no, nah, MF Doom's better. Oh, I think MF Doom's a better yeah, rapper than Freddie. Come on, bro. Like, no, I don't nah, like they're on like the same level. Come I don't on. like him. Matt Villainy wasn't even that good when you think about it. I said Matt Villainy wasn't even that good when you think about it. I mean, mm-mm, food is trash. So. Oh, boy, this nigga put so many fucking food references in the fucking in each rap. Like you bugging, nigga. Bro, I'm a big man. I can do that too. Wait, Action Bronson always does that. So what does that mean? That nigga's garbage. My God, you like Action Bronson?